for Tom Swift to be the first black gay lead on network TV is a beautiful, heartwarming, uh, um, all-encompassing thing that I didn't think I would be fortunate to get a, to be a part of, you know? What about this celebration during Pride Month is um, important to me? I mean, I think Pride Month should be every month, personally. And it should be every day. Pride, to me, means literally being proud of oneself, um, all of who you are, being completely, um, not just authentic, but I think also really full, full of yourself, full of all of yourself. And I, I think it's amazing to have an opportunity to be present in such a way, um, which a lot of queer people TG and CMB people, black trans people don't have access to, are not able to simply just walk in existence and be full of all of the parts of themselves. With Tom, you get to see a full life exist and still be light and fun. And I'm proud to be a part of that. Being a black trans masculine person on a show like this, um, being a part of not just like a, the series regular cast, but also the leading cast, which is like amazing. It's not something that I think that I would ever have imagined seeing on TV. Definitely not on network television, not in this way. It's giving people of the LGBT community uh, an opportunity for their voice to be heard and to be seen and to see, to see the struggles that we all face every day as humans. So it is absolutely advancing the, the, the inclusion of that. And I'm, I'm grateful to be part of that. This show just shows these people as human beings. And that's all it should be. It just shows these characters living their lives, having these experiences, whether positive or negative both emotionally, mentally, and physically. Everybody is different, but it's about being able to show the humanity and, and showing that people are people, regardless of how they identify, regardless of who they are attracted to. The reality is not everybody is accepting, especially in your own family, and that can be so painful. You don't get to a place of comfort and understanding of your identity without having gone through some things and lived it. I was fortunate enough to grow up and you know, find myself in an accepting family and to self-actualize without you know, my parents putting their expectations and pressures on me to be a certain way. And I got to establish what manhood is for me. So to now be at this place at my age um, feels beautiful because if I got a chance to, to see someone like Tom Swift exist on screen growing up, uh, the journey and the walk to self-acceptance and self-actualization would have looked a little different. I was raised by two moms. You know, I was raised by two moms. I have many queer people in my family, and it is no different than any other family or household. You know, people are people, and love really, truly is love. It, it, none of none of that stuff matters. I still was loved and supported and, and taken care of, and, and I love the fact that we are able to have television shows that show that, like, people are people. We're just out here living. We're trying to <laughs> survive just like everyone else. At the end of the day, we're all just humans living our best lives, and we should celebrate each other's uniqueness.